this fix applies for most um, Acura RS6, um, most Acura CS6, uh, Honda Civic, Honda Accord, uh, anything Honda, Acura, you will have this problem, the stupid SRS button. And um, one of the symptoms I've had is I started having trouble um, putting my seat belt and then I sprayed some WD-40 inside and the seat belt was starting to clip properly and um, I was having a lot of problems clipping the, the seat belt and then another thing you have to know is there's a button inside that when you click the seat belt it presses on the button that button um, there's a lot of dust and um, dirt so we're gonna take it out today and clean it up so you'll need a very small torque security right here torque security is it has a hole and it is a torx so it is star I'm gonna take it out like this sorry And afterwards, we're gonna use some alcohol, or you can just, uh, if you're lazy like me, you can buy some uh, electrical cleaners. Where's the English? Ah, there you go, electrical contact cleaner. So it's basically some uh, some alcohol, but in the spray can form. All right. It's very easy to do. Afterwards, we'll just have to reset the SRS light by shorting two of these. All right, so should be able to take it out there you go and then take out the other part the plastic and um, earlier I was explaining to you how this works is you when you put your seatbelt this goes here and it presses on the button and you see this is this is locked right now and when you push it, it goes out and then that's how it tells the computer if your seatbelt has been on put it on or not all right so I have removed the boot right here and it, it's it's exposing the button. We're gonna use some cleaner right here. So like I said, it's basically some uh, alcohol in the spray form. Oops, sorry. gonna spray some more so it's it's really not worth buying another seat belt especially those seat belt um, at the dealership they're around like 200 or 250 or um, and more clean up a bit with a rag a tissue you know and then we're gonna start clicking many times on it and hopefully this way the dirt will just come out and we're gonna spray one last time before we try it out so the whole point of this is to eliminate your problem because yes you can res reset the SRS but afterwards it's gonna come back because your problem is still there all right and we're gonna clip a few more times this way the button will start working better. All right, I guess we're done. I'm gonna put it back to plastic and we're gonna, we're, I'm gonna show you how to reset the SRS light. Hopefully find the yellow connector under the dash. Um, it's always under the driver's side dash right here. You see, this is the SRS connector and uh, it's right under the dash here. This one is the um, Civic EP3 hatchback SIR so every time um, we're gonna connect this wire like we're going to connect this wire right here to short uh, the connection between the two pins right here you can use a paper clip but I use decided to use a RG45 which is a Ethernet cable wire because it goes right in and uh, I don't have any paper clip at home but you should have paper clip at home and so we're gonna look, we're gonna put the ignition on with this connected. And every time the connect, um, the SRS light is light on, we leave it on. And every time the SRS light is off on the dash, we disconnect this one here, we pull it off. So we're gonna give it a try. I have to use one hand to film. Uh, we're going, I made some modifications. I cut both wires in two so I can, you know, like this to short and you know remove them 
to unshort. All right, so let's give it a try. All right, so we short these two wires together and then we put ignition on and you will see the light as far as on. It is on. So as soon as the SRS light is off, we okay, we disconnect these two wires and then it's going to come back. Once it comes back, well, put them back together. And after it comes back, goes off, take them out together. And then it's going to blink, blink twice to confirm that the SRS has been reset. Just to be on. the beep should be up, go off okay so that this means your SRS is no longer on even though you're on ignition I hope, it, I hope this video helped you guys out and um, good luck like I said you need to clean up the seat belt usually it's the driver's side because it's the most used otherwise the passenger side is possible too